Hello everyone. In this lesson, we will be discussing about sound arguments. What is a sound argument? An argument is a sound argument if it can satisfy two conditions. One is it must be a valid argument and the other one is its premises must be true premises. What is a valid argument? An argument is a valid argument if it can satisfy the logic condition. Logic condition verifies the logical connectivity of the given premises and the conclusion. Then an argument having true premises means it is satisfying the truth condition. Truth condition always verifies the truthfulness or the falsity of the given premises and the conclusion. Let us try to understand sound arguments with the help of few examples. All mammals are animals. All dogs are mammals. So, all dogs are animals. In this argument, is the logic condition satisfied? Yes, the logic condition is satisfied because the conclusion can be inferred from the given two premises. Premise 1 says all mammals are animals. From this premise, we can conclude all dogs are animals because all dogs are mammals. Hence, we say the argument is a valid argument because the logic condition is satisfied. Then what about the truth condition? Is the truth condition in the above argument satisfied? Yes, of course, the truth condition is also satisfied. Truth condition always looks for the truthfulness of the individual premises and the conclusion. When we look at the premises and the conclusion individually, each one of them is true in the world in which we are living. Hence, we say the truth condition is satisfied. Because the logic condition and the truth condition both are satisfied, we conclude that the argument is a sound argument. Let us take one more example. All birds are mammals. Pigeon is a bird. So pigeon is a mammal. Is the logic condition in the above argument satisfied? Yes, the logic condition is satisfied because the conclusion can be inferred from the given two premises. Because premise 1 says all birds are mammals, it leads to the conclusion that a pigeon is a mammal because pigeon is a bird. So we say the argument is a valid argument. Then what about the truth condition? Is the truth condition in this argument satisfied? No, the truth condition is not satisfied because when we look at premise 1, it says all birds are mammals, which is wrong because birds are not mammals. Because premise 1 is false, it leads to the wrong conclusion that a pigeon is a mammal just because it is a bird. So the truth condition in this argument is not satisfied. So we conclude that the argument is not a sound argument. A sound argument must have both the conditions satisfied. That is, the logic condition as well as the truth condition, both these conditions must be satisfied for an argument to be a sound argument. Let us look at one more example. All trees are plants. Cedar is a tree. So cedar is a plant. In this argument, is the logic condition satisfied? Yes, of course, the logic condition is satisfied because the conclusion can be inferred from the given two premises. There is a logical connectivity between the premises and the conclusion. Hence, we say the argument is a valid argument. Then what about the truth condition? Is the truth condition in this argument satisfied? Yes, the truth condition is also satisfied. Because when we look at the premises and the conclusion individually, each one of them is true in the world in which we are living in. 
Hence, we can conclude the truth condition is satisfied. So, this argument is a sound argument because both the logic condition and the truth condition are satisfied. Let us look at one more example. Broccoli is green. Some green things make me sick. Therefore, broccoli makes me sick. In this argument, is the logic condition satisfied? No, the logic condition is not satisfied. Because premise 2 says, some green things make me sick. So, this group of some green things may not be having broccoli included in them. So, the conclusion, broccoli makes me sick is not certain. That's why we say, this argument is not a valid argument because the logic condition is not satisfied. Because the certainty of the conclusion is questionable. Then what about the truth condition? Coming to the truth condition in this argument, it may be true or it may not be true. That's why we can conclude that this argument is not a sound argument. Now let's take one more example. If the moon is made of green cheese, then cows jump over it. The moon is made of green cheese. Therefore, cows jump over it. In this argument, is the logic condition satisfied? Yes, of course, the logic condition is satisfied because the conclusion can be inferred from the given two premises. Hence, this argument is a valid argument. Then what about the truth condition? Is the truth condition in this argument satisfied? No, the truth condition is not satisfied. Because when we look at the premise 1 individually, it is wrong. The moon is not made of green cheese. Because premise 1 is false, it leads to the wrong conclusion that cows can jump over it. Hence we say, it is not a sound argument because the truth condition is not satisfied. For a sound argument, both the logic condition and the truth condition must be satisfied. Now let's go through a summary on sound arguments. An argument is a sound argument if it can satisfy two conditions. One is it must be a valid argument, which means it should satisfy the logic condition. Logic condition verifies the logical connectivity of the given premises and the conclusion. Then it should satisfy the truth condition. Truth condition verifies the truthfulness or falsity of the given premises and the conclusion.